Did you ever ask yourself, you know, you hear all the time from people that say that historians recognize that the Constitution of the United States is the greatest political document ever conceived by man. Did you ever ask yourself if it's so good, why isn't anybody else doing it? This marks the beginning, not of a revolution, but it marks the beginning of an awakening. And we've crippled our own spirit. Well, that spirit will rise from the grave today. The fallacy of the CRA has brought our globe to the point of economic collapse, and the people who did it blame capitalism when they should be blaming themselves. Blaming capitalism is nothing new. They did the same thing back during the New Deal. I think we can agree that we're all pretty unhappy. And it's not that we're unpatriotic or selfish or anything like that. It's the cost. The fact that I can do way more with my own money than the government can. And most of all, these days, it's where that money is going. Right. This TV party and thousands like it, it today are only the beginning. Every movement was once an idea, once an individual, a spark that caught fire. We need this passion to continue and to burn all the way to Washington, D.C. But every city and state has something like our tunnel. Everyone has it. This is one big reason why you need to keep your money and spend and invest your money the way you want to, because government doesn't know how to spend money. John Maynard Keynes was wrong. Not all demand is equal. What is all this spending for? Do you know? They don't you know? even know. I don't know what it's all for. Will all this government spending and intervention help America? Will it help us? We all love our country. We know that our country was built on certain principles and values. We are concerned about our country. We want our elected representatives to hear us. I just, I want to say, get active, get out there, educate yourself. Take the fight to them. It's not too late. God bless you. God bless America. Thank you. Please know, I am not a political activist. I do not have a political bone in my body. I am a highly tormented citizen who wakes up every day wondering what new pronouncement my government is going to give me about how I'm going to live. We as American need to take back our education system. Yeah. We as Americans need to take back our government.